Okay, so here is my fix for the, um, the motorized slider that I have, or for the slider that I have. It's a newer 47-inch uh, graphite slider. Um, it comes pretty much put together, has some leveling legs. It has mounts for uh, light stands or tripods or, you know, just about anything you need to do. But it, it's hand-movable, so in other words, you have to use your hand to move it, and it has to be pretty steady. So if you have little little stops and starts or glitches in your hand movement, then this is going to look kind of weird on, on video, especially if you're going really slow. So I decided I already had the newer, or sorry, the newer um, motorized three wheel dolly. So I thought, well, it's supposed to go on here and it doesn't fit right. I'm going to say that right off the bat. It does not fit on this slide frame correctly. I tried to, do, to adjust it. I, I actually grinded some of the metal off to, to, to try to see if I could get it to fit right. It does not fit right. It's a little bit too big to go over the two slide rails um, with any amount of uh, grip. So needless to say, on top of that, you will see a, wet, a, wet, a lead weight that I use to help weigh it down so that it can get a little bit of traction. Um, I also, on the rail that the, uh, the motorized uh, wheel is going on, I also put some, uh, I guess you could call it grip tape, like you would put on a tennis racket or something like that. It's really thin, so it's not, not even noticeable on there. It doesn't slow down the uh, the, the actual non-motorized dolly at all. So, But I thought I would try this. Um, you can see I used a, uh, a ruler that I got at Walmart. I just It's a metal ruler, but it does have a little bit of corking on it. Um, but I cut it down, and I bent it to where it would bolt onto the, uh, the, the non-motorized dolly that is actually affixed to the rail and then um, go over and then then uh, just tap onto that screw uh, you can use it without the weight um, you can also actually put a 3 8 inch nut on there if you'd like to to make sure that it uh, make sure that it stays down or stays attached or whatever you want to say but um, the weight makes sure that that motorized dolly will actually get the traction that it needs to pull a big camera it'll even pull my uh, Nikon D7500 with a yeah, decent size lens, not a huge lens, but a decent lens. But again, all the, the bigger lenses are off balance anyways, so I wouldn't even try them on here. But at least this way, I can mount the camera onto the non-motorized dolly. It will stay there because it's actually attached to the rail, so it's not going to tip over. The motorized dolly will tip over and fall off of these rails if you do not have it um, weighted down. And even if you did have a bigger camera on there, it, it could still fall over. That was the reason why I wanted to go this way. Um, it does work. It's fairly cheap. It cost me, what, $4 or something like that for the ruler and some nuts that I didn't use, didn't, didn't end up using or anything. Um, but still, you know, for, for a little project, it, it works, and I like doing little projects, so um, I will show some little photos and stuff of what I've done here, and then I will also show what, uh, what it looks like using this slider. Okay, so here is an, an image uh, captured from Amazon of the slider. This is the uh, three-wheel motorized um, wireless, whatever you want to call it, dolly. Now here you can see my little bend in the in the ruler, how it's bolted onto the frame. This is a little bit bigger image. Um, you can see it a little bit more together. Again, you can see that how that ruler's bent and then bolts onto the frame. And then here's the bolt. It's a, just a three eighths inch uh, carriage bolt, uh, not carriage bolt. Yeah, whatever. Anyways, um, just another view of it. Here's with the weight on it. Um, this is a little bit more close up. You can see how it bolts down into that frame. Here is without it. Now there is a grommet on there, so it will go down on that uh, 3 8 inch nut a little bit further, or the 3 8 inch threads a little bit further. There's the whole thing. Um, again, here's a little bit better view of it. 